So you have the center point made from the shape of the parameter, and that center point has a circle around it that is made from the boundaries of the parameter. It has to be that size. The center point has to be there. Look at the concept that you're dealing with a series of threes as a key. You can imagine that you'll probably have three of these circles. And so if you take one circle, and you line it up with the center line next to the center point of this first circle, you will end up exactly at the edge of the rectangle. The center point of the two circles will cross at exactly the quarter point of this dynamic symmetry. Here, based on forced location, there's not a choice here, it's the location. That's where the circle has to end. That's the center of the rectangle. And so from that, you just draw out points to the center and then to all the locations that each geometric next point. And you can use these as light rays. And that's where he'll get his lights from the geometry in the spaces. The way all of this lines up is absolutely incredible. I mean, Look at, look at how these points all move in the same way across the face.